In the Bible, there are three men who are said to have never died. Each of these men had a unique relationship with God and played an important role in the history of the Bible. Enoch. Enoch, the great-grandfather of Noah, is the first man in the Bible to be said to have never died. Enoch was a prophet, and he warned the people of his time about the coming judgment of God. According to the Bible, Enoch lived for 365 years before God took him away. Genesis 5 verse 24 states, Enoch walked with God, and he was not, for God took him. This verse tells us that Enoch had a close relationship with God and that God chose to take him to heaven without him experiencing physical death. The book of Hebrews also mentions Enoch and states that he was a witness to the coming of Jesus Christ, Hebrews 11 verse 5. Elijah. Elijah was a prophet during the reign of King Ahab and Queen Jezebel in Israel. He was known for his boldness in speaking out against the idols and false gods that the people of Israel had begun to worship. He also performed many miracles, such as bringing fire down from heaven to prove that the God of Israel was the true God, 2 Kings 1 verses 10-12. He was used by God to bring about repentance and reform in Israel. The Bible tells us that Elijah was taken up into heaven in a whirlwind, without experiencing death, 2 Kings 2 verse 11. As they were walking along and talking together, suddenly a chariot of fire and horses of fire appeared and separated the two of them, and Elijah went up to heaven in a whirlwind. Melchizedek. Melchizedek is only mentioned in a few passages in the Bible, but his role is significant. Melchizedek was the king of Salem and a priest of God Most High, Genesis 14 verse 18. He met Abraham and blessed him after he had rescued his nephew Lot from captivity. The book of Hebrews states that Melchizedek was, without father or mother, without genealogy, without beginning of days or end of life, Hebrews 7 verse 3. This is interpreted to mean that he had no human lineage and was not subject to death. 